Hello YouTube, Jack's Guns and Equipment back again with another video. Today we got in a package from Optics Planet and we picked up a few things for a couple different projects. So let's get right into it. Shut up and sit down. Okay guys, so as I said, I got in a, an order from Optics Planet, and I ordered a couple random things that, uh, that I needed for different things, and uh, I only ordered three things, but the, uh, the items that I purchased today are for a couple different projects, like I said. Uh, first of all, I'm in the process of buying parts to put together a 6.5 Grindle, and they had... They had mags. I picked up one 10 round mag. Um, the gun's going to be used for hunting, so I didn't want a big mag. A 10 round is plenty, and that's what I picked up. And honestly, these are hard to find. Um, I mean, not hard to find, but hard to find at an affordable price. Uh, the uh, Like eBay, for instance, they're 25 bucks. Um, some other places are over 20 I think I picked this one up for like, uh, what was it? Oh, well, I can't find a price right at the moment, but I think it was like 16 bucks or something like that. And I got free shipping. I got the order up to get free shipping. So it was on sale and I needed one because the build isn't together. I'm still lacking a couple parts, but I figured I'm going to have to have a magazine to have a gun, right? So I went ahead and picked that up and uh, I'll let you know more about it once I get the gun together and get to use it. Um, the next thing I bought is kind of big to put on film, but I'll show you part of it. Is I bought me um, one of these large AR-15 mats. Um, it's actually bigger than I was expecting. Um, it's for a workbench that I'm in the process of putting that together as well. Uh, a workbench for my guns. I bought a small vise and. I bought the mat and just working on different stuff there to get a nice little workbench together uh, for my man cave to work on ARs and such. So I needed a mat. Uh, well, I wanted a mat for multiple reasons, but I needed one, something for the uh, workbench. So I picked that up. It was also on sale. I think I paid like 12 bucks for it. Um, it wasn't a very expensive order. Um, so like I said, putting together a 6.5 Grendel, but I already have a 223 and a 16 inch um, AR-15, and I will get around to making a video on that uh, eventually, but I haven't got around to it yet. But I'm just running a regular flash hider on that, and I've bought a couple other muzzle devices, but I haven't actually put anything on yet, and I wanted to try an actual muzzle brake. And I read reviews on this and really good reviews and it was on sale for 27 bucks and once again free shipping so I thought it was a pretty good buy so I picked up the J comp gen 2 uh, obviously still in the box I haven't even pulled it out yet but uh, I'm gonna get this um, get this on the gun soon on the rifle and when I do that I hope to uh, do a video up whenever I'm putting that on too. Not necessarily the actual installment, but just a before and after the A2 flash hider versus the compensator, and then hopefully get some footage of, of shooting it later on. Uh, but I read really good reviews on this, and it got really, really nice reviews. Strike Industries seems to be a pretty good company with fairly affordable parts, and I didn't have a compensator. I had a flash hider, I had a basic A2 flash hider and I have an extended uh, flash hider and I wanted to try out a compensator so but I didn't want to put a fortune into it so I went with this. The one cool thing is the barrel on my 223 is diamond fluted stainless steel and it has a stainless steel A2 flash hider so the black muzzle device I think will look good. Um, tell me what you think in the comments below. Or, I mean, maybe you have a gun like that with a stainless barrel and a black muzzle device, or maybe maybe you have another setup. But uh, 
that's for the 223, like I said. So has nothing to do with the Grendel, has nothing to do with the mat, but uh, ordered three different things that I was working on for various reasons. And wanted to give you guys a quick vid to show you that uh, I'm picking up stuff and uh, there'll be more videos to come soon. I appreciate you guys watching and I hope you like and subscribe and there'll be more to come soon. Take care.